so. You have arrived at your destination. Hola! What do you think? Ah, very nice. Where's the Vocho? Oh, I'm taking my time with it. Don't worry, Superstar. Sometimes sock tampoco está tan mal. May the best mechanic go win. <laughs> ah, so that's how it is. Okay then. a shorter route. Go straight ahead. You are now following the shorter route. Anna, whose side are you on, amiga? <laughs> Incorrect. There is no fixed route for this encounter. I am providing navigational assistance. <laughs> oh, I'd high five you if I could, Anna. You have now returned to the main route. to the garage. Call me. Hola, amigo. Guess who has the watch running as well as it did in 1963? It would be really good for some rally driving. We could do that here. If you prefer rally cross and showing off some Gymkhana skills, we could do that here. You choose and meet me there. Want to test out the Watcho on a rally course? Josie. Turn around, 
safe to do so. yards you arrive at your destination. Míralo. My abuelita Rosa told me about the first time Papa Fernando saw a Volkswagen Beetle. When they brought them to Mexico in 1954 to race the Carrera Panamericana. It looks great. Can I? You bet. I've marked up a nice rally route for you. I'll be your co-driver. Easy left into easy left. Easy right, don't cut, then over a jump. Easy right, then over a jump. Easy right, then sharp left. Over a jump, then water, into sharp right and surface change. Easy left, don't cut, then surface change. Easy left, then easy right, don't cut. Surface change, into easy left. Well done. Can you imagine taking this 3,000 kilometers across Mexico back in the 50s? Papa Fernando said it was proof the Wacho could do anything. He sounds like a great guy. I wish I'd known him. Hola, mi amigo. Mi familia has been coming to visit the Wacho while I've been working on it in the shop. They've told me the most amazing stories you wouldn't believe. Tio Oscar says Papa Fernando actually drove for a rally team for a while. He competed in the Baja, maybe even Dakar. We could recreate one of his runs. Tia Sofia told me he once put his Wacho through the roof of a building. We could recreate his jumps. Probably leave out the building, though. Your choice. I'll take care of the setup. Meet me in the Baja. This bocho eats up cross country like my tío eats tamales. <laughs> On my way!
turn around when it is safe to do so. What do you think? Mi tío Victor told me Papa Fernando used to race around Guanajuato before street scene, before horizon, before they even called it Gymkana. It looks great. Can I? You bet. This is a great area for some Gymkana. I've set up a course. Show me what you and the Bocho can do.
Right, andale. I've started the timer. Let's do this. Working on it, I found some mounting bolts up on the chassis. I think he was messing with the ride height somehow. Not sure why yet, but he was way ahead of his time with his car. Fantastic driving. Feel free to, you know, stop. I really wonder what he was trying to do with his car. <laughs> I'll get you back up on the lift and have another look. Seems like this car really does run in the family. <laughs> you have no idea. in the Baja. This bocho eats up cross-country like my tío eats tamales. <laughs> On my way! Turn around when it is safe to do so. Recalculating route. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Some more modifications. I've tried to get it as close as possible to how Papa Fernando and a rally team would have built it. Really? <laughs> What's the problem? You don't think they would have taken a little modern technology if it made the bocho go faster? Just get in and hang on. <laughs> Understood. Rowdy set. I'll call out waypoints as we go. Are you ready for a time trial? I'm ready for anything in this. Nice slide. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Wait, wait, one, I'm at it. Watch the body work, I just feel that. Guys, nice. next waypoint is up now. Got it. 200 yards, turn right. In 400 yards, turn left. When I had it up on the lift, there was so much damage on the under train. When Papa Fernando raised his hocho, he raced it hard. I replaced the tray and rebuilt the shocks. Should be good. How's the handling? Uh, it's good. Busy now, though. Got another waypoint for you. Check. Turn around. 
around when it is safe to do so. drive my friend I couldn't find a driver named Fernando Torres in the records for the Baja 500 or the Baja 1000 but that doesn't mean he didn't enter what about the Dakar Africa is a long way for a little bocho maybe that was just a story he told to uncle Oscar and the other kids in the family I know I would have sat and listened to him for hours hmm official or not he must have been quite a racer see si, he was vamos Hola, mi amigo. I found Papa Fernando in an old car magazine. It has much information on the work he did to the bocho. I can't wait to try some of this stuff out. For fast handling and corners, we could go here. Or for straight line speed, here. There's a speed trap here. I bet it's never seen a bocho like ours. Hey Jason, we're ready to expand. What are you thinking this time? Turn around when it is safe to do so. In 400 yards, turn left. In 100 yards, turn left. some American collectors at the festival last night and they said they were close to tracking down a stone cold classic right here in Mexico. So I was thinking if we find it first. Recalculating route in 400 yards. Turn on. You have arrived at your destination.
Take a look at this. I like it. I don't understand it, but I like it. Get in and I'll explain. You can stop now. <laughs> I fixed the brakes. That was fantastic. This thing is fast. It's really special, right? Just wait till you see what Papa Fernando did with it next. It's me again. You think you can get a bocho sideways? I've been playing around with the wheel angle. Meet me here if you want to get your drift on. I've also got an idea for an assault course. Let's meet here if you want to try that. 